Hello everyone, um, I'm back! <laughs> As you may or may not have noticed, I didn't make a video two weeks ago. As it happened, I got some really bad news that day and I just wasn't in the right space or place of mind rather to be able to film and in fact it set me back a couple of days on work as well so then by the time I was over that it took me a really long time to just get back to get back to where I was supposed to be and I think I've actually only gotten there now. That Friday was actually the first time that I felt like an international student. Up until that point I felt like I was just like everybody else and that I was experiencing the same things at the same times as all the other uh, students in my college but when I wanted to go home, that moment that I really needed or rather wanted to go home and it wasn't just a bus ride or a train ride away, that's when things changed and that's when there was a difference. I had to evaluate whether or not it was worth the time and the money to fly home, which in the end unfortunately it wasn't. But. That was the first time that I really felt like there was a difference between me and the other students. Congratulations to everybody for surviving fifth week, that's quite an accomplishment it seems. I actually found seventh week harder because by that time every hour that I had spent procrastinating seems to have caught up with me and I was way behind on so many things and in fact I'm still, I think I'm almost caught up now. But yeah, seventh week was just ugh. <laughs> one thing after another basically. So yeah. Seventh week blues are now a thing, I have decided. I don't think I've mentioned this on the vlog before, but I've actually been rowing for the past seven weeks. We have one practice session during the week, and then we also have a couple of training sessions that are more or less voluntary, but obviously you do much better if you go to as many of them as you can. Unfortunately, I've had so many other commitments that I haven't managed to go to that many, so I'm not great, but I enjoy it, so I'm not going to stop. We had our first big rowing event this week, which was the Christchurch Regatta. It's the first time that novice teams get to race against other colleges. So how it works is that there are two teams on the river and they race against each other, the winning team goes to the next level and the losing team has another race where they compete with another college and that's to see where they stand on the rankings. So I only managed to row once this week because I had a couple of classes that conflicted with our race times. And even though we didn't win the race, I'm still really glad that we participated because it was such a fun experience in and of itself and I felt like I couldn't come to Oxford and not at least try rowing so I'm glad I did that and tonight we actually have the boat club dinner which is where all the college teams so the men's team the women's team the coaches anybody who has anything to do with the boat club basically comes together for an evening of lots of yummy 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 food and fancy dresses and uh, yeah so I'm looking forward to that it's actually even about an hour and a half so <laughs> that's soon as Rebecca and Rhys already pointed out, it's Oxmas. It hasn't quite sorted out Peters yet, unlike other colleges it seems. We had our first event yesterday, which was Friday night, and that was when the JCR uh, decorated their tree. Tomorrow night we have a carol service and the MCR will decorate their archery. And then we have a couple more events throughout the week that are Christmas themed. For example, we're having like a mulled wine afternoon type thing where we're going to have a secret Santa event where everybody just, you know, I'm sure you know how secret Santa works. Um, and then this Friday we have our Oxmas dinner and a bop afterwards and that's going to be really fun and a really great way to end term, I think. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> I will actually also still be around for ninth week because I will have quite a bit of work to do and since I'm going home and won't have access to the libraries and I do have quite a few papers due in at the beginning of Hillary term, I'll be spending at least a week here just making photocopies and scans and seeing what I need and doing some research so that I can work from home and don't have a panic when I'm home and realize I have nothing to work on. Um, so yeah, I'll make a video of that during ninth week too. My mom's coming to visit for the last couple of days of term this week so I'll be going around doing lots of touristy stuff again so I'll make sure I'll film something so I can show you more. If there's anything specific that you want me to show you please let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to try and film that for you and show you in ninth week. If you have any other questions please do let us know. I'm more than happy to help out where I can. Um, if you have any questions about being an international student or being a master's student or if it's just you know, anything at all that I can try help you with, I'll do my best. So bye bye, see you ninth week.